It's like, I love Disney's content. I grew up watching, you know, all of the classics. They have been a huge, like, informative <laughs> part of my life. But at the same time, like, I worked at small studios most of my career, and I'd heard, you know, you hear whispers. Like, I'd, I'd heard things like, oh, you know, they won't let you show this at a Disney show. And I'm like, okay. So I was a little, like, sus when I started. And, but then my experience sus. was bafflingly the opposite of what I had heard on my little pocket of like, you know, proud family, Disney TVA. Um, the showrunners were super welcoming Meredith Roberts and like the, the, our leadership over there has been so welcoming to like my, like not at all secret gay agenda. And so like, I, I feel like I felt like it was, I mean, like maybe it was that way in the past, but I guess like something must have happened in the last like, like they're turning it around, they're going hard. And then all that like momentum that I felt like that sense of, I don't have to be afraid to like, let's have these two characters kiss. Let's in the background, to start. like I was just wherever I could just basically adding queerness to like, the, if you see anything queer in the show, I'm proud of them. But like, I, I just was like, no one would stop me and no one was trying to stop me. All right, be honest. When did you guys start seeing the truth? Okay, so if you go back in time and, you know, pick any Disney movie and rewatch it, if you're paying close enough attention, you can point something out that's just dead wrong with the movie. I mean, like, really dead wrong. Like, oh, you know, you, you hear all the, the theories about how Disney's satanic. Well, they're not just theories, guys. If you do your research, you'll you'll find out the truth. And this shouldn't come as a surprise because they've been pushing this for a long time. If you go back and look through history, you'll see throughout Disney's work that Disney was a pedophile. Or a perv, if you prefer that word. And this stuff is probably like a dream come true for him, basically. Parents, if you're watching this, I would stop getting Disney movies for your kids because... Disney is not the, the family-friendly safe heaven that y you, you think it is. One movie I would recommend watching is a movie called Out of Shadows. It was a very informative and eye-opening movie that talked about Walt Disney, CIA, Hollywood, and their whole agenda and their whole plan for our entertainment and our, our movies, basically. And you watch this movie and you just see how much crap is in Hollywood and how much crap is in these movies that we watch. How much crap is in Disney movies? And honestly, it just shouldn't come as a surprise. It doesn't come as a surprise to me. I found out about this stuff a couple years back.